Sarah Ferguson and Prince Andrew remain on remarkably good terms despite their divorce in 1996. And in a new interview with Samara Garcia Mendez from Ola TV this week, she was asked about the speculation regarding Andrew and his home. There has been much speculation about Royal Lodge, following multiple reports that King Charles has told Andrew to vacate his 98-acre home of 20 years. According to The Telegraph, Andrew has no plans to move house, however. Instead, he intends to honor the terms of the lease he signed in 2003 which still has 55 more years to run. It has been suggested that if the Duke did move from Royal Lodge, he would move to nearby Frogmore Cottage, the former home of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. And Sarah has now addressed the ongoing speculation. Asked about reports that she and Andrew will be moving into the cottage, Sarah replied, Don't always believe what you read. Pushed further, she then added, I don't know. I take every day as it comes. Earlier this year, King Charles made a cut to this brother's annual allowance of £249,000, effectively pricing him out of the running costs of the 30-room Royal Lodge. Andrew, who relies on the allowance since he left royal duties in 2019, moved into the Grade 2 listed house in Windsor Great Park following the death of the Queen Mother in 2002. The lease agreement required Andrew to carry out, at his own expense, refurbishments estimated at £7.5 million. Under the terms of the agreement, Andrew may not benefit financially from any increase in the value of the property as the freehold belongs to the Crown Estate. The leasehold may be assigned to his widow or his two daughters, Princesses Beatrice and Eugenie, or a trust established solely for their benefit. If he terminates the lease, the property would revert to the Crown Estate and he would be entitled to compensation for the refurbishment costs incurred up to a maximum of just under £7 million. Andrew has made just a handful of public appearances since stepping back from public duties in November 2019, following his TV interview with BBC Newsnight, which focused on his connections to convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein. In February 2022, he reached an undisclosed out-of-court settlement with Virginia Jufri, after she sued him claiming she was trafficked by Epstein to have sex with the royal when she was 17 and a minor under U.S. law. Andrew has vehemently denied the allegations. Ahead of the U.S. lawsuit, the late Queen stripped Andrew of his honorary military roles and he stopped using the style His Royal Highness in any official capacity. Interview courtesy of Ola. TV